What's up guys, I'm gonna be going through this V2 that I'm standing right in front of. So when I first started off, I was looking at it and trying to plan out how I was gonna go about doing it. The hardest part about this one was I was really used to positive grips and then these were kind of hard to hold for me. Round and didn't really have that much of a good grip. So in the beginning, I really just kept slipping. My, my fingers just kept slipping off, but I kept trying and trying it until I got used to the grip. I kind of learned the best way to position myself in order to make it feel a bit more positive. On the second one, the problem that happened was my feet, I was kind of too focus on my hands and my feet started swinging around and they weren't staying on the footholds so that one I just let go because it started to hurt and the next one I was getting more used to the movement I was finally finding out a way that I could hold the the hand grips better I skipped the first handhold you see that's closer to me on that reach because the grip on it was just really bad and the, the one right after it had a pretty good hold and then I got into this position and from there, I tried to kind of push myself upwards. That's what I had in mind. And the thing is, once I got here, I didn't really think I would get this far because I was stuck on the part before for so long. So I was kind of just winging it here. And I didn't really know what to do. My grip in my hands and my skin were just starting to get really tired. It just started to burn. Right here, I was kind of just finding a way that I could like shake my hands off, but it was just making things worse. Everything was just getting like harder and harder. And then I didn't really know what to do from here and I ended up just falling off. So I scrubbed it off and then this is the next one. So in the next one, I was basically going through the beginning process that you saw before. I'm, I was starting to get better and better at it. And then same process. So right here, I was thinking about matching feet after I get both hands on those handholds. But then I kind of missed the grip and just fell off. I think I was focused too much on something else. So, took my glasses off because things started getting serious. Skip that hold. Had a cleaner foot match there and got into that position I want to be in. Um, from here, I pushed myself upwards. So, right here, I went for a, a different grip. I kind of held it from the bottom but it kind of just made things worse. I think I was kind of just trying new things here. Like right here, I was just barely holding on. I put my foot up on that where my hand was and then I was in this position. And in this position, I didn't really know where to put my feet. So I kind of just, I didn't really plan it. I just kind of reached for the top and my foot was just kind of swinging around trying to find where to go. So I really stopped and paused and took the time to really think about where I'm going to put all my all my body parts when I start doing it again. Basically at this point, I was kind of just doing this first part very easy. It was getting much easier than before. And then I was in this position that that you've seen before where I, my goal after this is to push off. So I pushed off and then did that thing again where I kind of took it from under. I don't know why I did that. I guess I just thought it would be a better grip, but I just went for it again. So same beginning part that you've seen before. And I think here I ended up just slipping off. Yep. And then I met Sean, he was right behind me. So then he gave me a bit of advice. We talked about the problem a bit, like how I should approach that part I was stuck on. I took another try at it, same beginning. I matched feet, put my foot on that foothold to the right, got my hand over, and then from there it's the push off. 
And then, yeah, I'm telling you guys now, you guys and girls, that I ended up doing the problem right, I think on this one, but uh, I didn't tell anyone I was recording, so people just kind of stood in the way. Next time, I'll either let people know or put the camera higher up, but I'm gonna go back and literally tomorrow I'm gonna do it again just so I can put the video clip of me doing it and then I'll kind of link it in this one. Basically, I just, yeah, it sucks that I didn't, yeah, but I put my foot up there and then I pushed off and I used that handhold on the, on the top one to get both hands on it and then I knew where to put my feet. My feet were going where my right hand was before. And then from there I was able to push off, kind of turning my arm, my right arm down and pushing off and then getting my legs higher and higher. So I got the left leg higher and then from there I'm tall enough to reach the top so I kind of just reached for it and touched it with both hands and I jumped off. Now I'm gonna put a link in the description that shows me actually doing the problem, nothing in the way, but I said I was gonna post every week and it's Sunday so I wanna get this video out and then I'll see how I can show you all now that I know how to approach the problem. Anyways, thanks for watching. That was a yellow V2 at my gym. Thanks for watching.